Man is who they think they are. Man is what they think they are. I am who I think I am. And if we don't think that we're great, beautiful, awesome, and amazing, then how can someone else think that of us, of yourself, of who you are? I know who I am. And it took me many years to get where I am mentally. If we don't change the way that we think, our lives will stay the same. And if you don't believe it, stay in that negative mindset that you've been in for many years and I guarantee you nothing will change. If you change your mind, you change your life. And you have to believe that. It takes for you to believe and to have faith that you can change anything about who you are, about what comes your way. And you can change the people that you allow in your life. The ones that bring you that negative energy, you don't have to deal with those people. See, you have to remember that we are responsible for what happens to our lives, what goes on in our lives. And don't get me wrong, there are some things that are uncontrollable. But you take it and look at it in a positive aspect. And it's going to change. There is a solution to every single problem, every single issue in life. You have to sit back. And, and what, is, what does God say? Be still. Be still. And the solution to that problem will come to you. We got a negative thought and a positive thought. Your brain is always working. Learn to sit back and be still and to be able to figure out which thought you need to listen to. Because sometimes the things we know we shouldn't do, we do them anyway because of emotions. But if you sit back and wait and wait... The answer is going to come to you. Nobody teaches us this as teenagers. I wasn't taught this. And I ended up in so many predicaments that I didn't need to be in. And I've learned over the years how to just sit back and be still. We can do and be Anything we want in this life. All it takes is for you to do it. Fear stops us from doing so many things. If you got something going on in your head that's telling you that you need to do this. Something that you need to pursue. But you keep putting it on the back burner. I'm telling you, write it down on a piece of paper and follow the steps that you wrote a little bit at a time and I guarantee it's going to work out. Even if you don't have the money to do it, do it one step at a time with the little bit of money you have and you'll get there. You'll get there. Sometimes we take ourselves and allow ourselves to be involved with other people's journeys, gifts. And then we put ours to the side and we let other individuals wear us out when we can wear ourselves out doing something for ourselves. And I just thought that I would give you a little bit of positivity this morning. Like I tell you guys, I'm always thinking when I'm in my car. 
So know who you are. Know who you are. We are who we think we are. And if you wake up in the morning and tell yourself, I'm already having a bad day, your day would be bad all day. All day your day would be bad. I wake up every day and I say, thank you. Just thank you. Thank you. Just so blessed to be alive. So blessed to breathe, walk, see, hear. There's so many people out there that can't have the things that I have when I wake up. And some of those people are more happier than a lot of other, a lot of us. So take what you have and be grateful for what you have. Be grateful. Everybody have a happy, amazing, great, and awesome day. I love you.